All right. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the first um, processing lesson here in Learn Computer Science. And let's start by saying what processing actually is. Um, many of you will have heard about Java. Java is a programming language that is platform independent and it's great. It's really good for the beginners. Um, so processing is another language based on Java um, that essentially aims to let the very beginner in programming um, start programming in a very visual fashion. It lets you implement images and graphics and um, key presses and those sort of events really easily in your programs from the get-go. So it's really good if you're starting programming to start with processing since it um, since it lets you see what you're making really quickly. So it's really motivating when you're starting programming to start with processing because you you just, uh, the stuff you program changes the program you're making in a way that lets you um, see a difference really fast. Um, and that's processing. This is the processing IDE, really simple. Just write the stuff here um, and you can have various files to your program there. We'll we'll go through all those parts um, in the next tutorial. But yeah, this is basically the processing IDE, integrated development environment. This is the console area. If you have any errors or stuff like that, they will appear here. This is where you write a text, play, lets you play your program, stop, stops your program. Then you got the, all of these. Processing can export applications. Um, to play in the web, but that we won't go through that this time. Um, and you can get processing really easily as well. You just go to processing.org, and then you get this website, um, and you go to download processing, and you download your version. So in this case, I'm using a Mac, so I would download this version. But if you're using Windows or Linux, you can download your your versions. Most likely 64-bit nowadays. If you're using an older computer, maybe you want to download the 32-bit. Um, depending on, on your operating system, that is. Um, and that's pretty much it. So what we're going to learn is basically how to make a simple um, game where you will move um, your object, your character around the screen, and um, you will have to eat the apples and dodge the obstacles falling from the sky. Um, Pretty much like a snake game, only that the snake won't be growing, and instead of um, just having to eat the apples or nothing else, you'll have to dodge the obstacles coming from the sky. It's going to be a fairly complex game, um, but by the end of it, you will um, you'll basically um, know a bit more, know a bit more programming, know how to work around processing and how to use it, um, and it will all be good. So I hope you guys will find that interesting and tune in to the next one. I'll see you guys.